Hello, everybody. It is Reed Mahalko of readaboutsex.com for whataretheyasking.com. Today's question of the week, how do you gain sensitivity in your cock? Well, well, well. Well, one way you could gain sensitivity is not use a condom, but I don't recommend that. Um, what I would recommend is um, practicing uh, masturbating with a little gentler of a grip, maybe practicing different sensations, different strokes, using your fingertips, using your thumbs, using a vibrator, using lube, using that lube, actually practicing and focusing in on what does sensation actually feel like in your penis and the different areas of your cock that are sensitive and what kinds of touch, what kind of strokes, what kinds of sensation do they like. You know, everything from a silk scarf to, uh, well, I wouldn't recommend a Brillo pad or anything like that, but you get the picture. Most of us, uh, people who were, were born with penises, um, have the kind of kung fu depth grip that we use when masturbating um, or when we get really excited and trying to create a lot of sensation and stimulation. Um, what you want to do is kind of take a couple of steps back and see how little sensation you can actually pick up and figure out what kind of sensation excites you the most. So think of it more about creating um, and exploring a range of sensation, everything from super ferocious to super delicate and light, and increase your ability to pay attention to and pick up those sensations. So that would be one way to kind of you know, create a, a project for yourself around how you want to explore your body and teach yourself how to be able to pick up more and more sensation. So in this case, variety and exploring that variety would, um, would help a lot. You could also play with temperature, you know, warm, like warm up your lube maybe, um, versus like cold lube, you know, stick it in the fridge for a little bit and be like, wow, what's that about? Um, again, like variety and paying attention. You want to start to practice getting into your body. Don't forget to breathe. You know, let out sound <sighs> while you're exploring yourself. Um, and then, of course, you get the great delight um, for those of us lucky enough when we have uh, somebody who will touch our genitals. Um, have them do similar things. Have when you have the opportunity, people exploring your body and exploring your genitals with lots of different kinds of sensation so that you can begin to learn your own body. And then last but not least, there's always the PC muscle squeeze. So if and when you're urinating next time, um, try to you know, squeeze your PC muscles, your, your butt and your, and your groin muscles to stop the peeing. Um, that's, those are your PC muscles. And practice the next time you're masturbating. Um, or having somebody else explore your body. Practice pumping those muscles and squeezing your ass and maybe you know rotating your hips and getting a little hump to hump into your motion to see what engaging your pelvic floor muscles and your legs and your buttocks into your masturbatory routine. See what kind of uh, change or difference in sensation that gets you. All these things are just different ways for you to start checking in and learning how to listen to your own body and, and give yourself more crayons in your crayon box of how to create sensation so that you can start to become a ninja around your penis. I hope this was helpful. Readaboutsexguy.com for whataretheyasking.com. What questions do you want us to answer?